my Planet Cravers, it's your girl Sandy. I am back with another video. Guys, I am so ready to close out May. It's not a joke. Hi guys, if you are returning subscribers, hello, thank you for coming back. You are loyal, I appreciate you. And if you have not seen none of my videos and it's your first time, please hit the notification bell because you do not want to miss any more videos. So, <clears throat> So, you know, you guys, we just did, oh, there's a sneak peek again. I keep doing that to you guys. So, I still have to do my last week. So, right now, it is the 27th. So, right now, I'm working into this. Um, so far, I'm doing good, guys. So far, I'm doing good. So far, so far, I'm doing so good. And, like I said, I'm not doing my sneaky for my cash envelopes. I only did it, actually, for one month of this year. I'm going to get back into it. It just seems been tight, and I don't actually have any like extra good funds on the side to add to my cash envelopes but in the meantime i am still going to plan out my sinking funds and maybe we'll go back and visit that later so but in the meantime between time guess what guys <gasps> we got the may budget that we still have to do i haven't forgotten i know it's is pretty much i'm done with all the bills for the month so i'm ready to get it done get it over with and we're going to start off with first announcing that I have some happy mail. I'm so excited that I have some happy mail because um, I actually cheated and I'm going to let you guys know. <laughs> I'm going to let you guys know that I cheated. But I do have some good things going on in here. Let's go ahead and get to this. See, I told y'all I opened it up already. I, I couldn't I couldn't hold it, guys. I couldn't hold it. I had brought it. I came from work. I can't show you yet. Boom. Boom, boom, boom. Okay, that's it. So, <laughs> I had ordered from yet another, another shop. And I want to let you guys know that this shop is called BDL Design Co. I love this shop. And look what I got. Look at the freebies that I got, guys. I got this big clip here. Love it. And I also got one with the bulb on it. I just really I always wanted one. And, like, I was like, oh, I got one, so now I can add this little doodad to my planner. Make it look a little spiffy. And also got a note. It's from Beverly. It says, Sandy, thank you so much. I truly appreciate it. I hope you enjoyed your goodies. Absolutely, Beverly. Thank you so much. I'm going to put her shop down below, um, of course, with the other shops that I have featured this month. And, of course, guess what, guys? I got another rose gold. Rose gold. I got another rose gold pen that I'm going to use, and I cannot wait. Oh, so guess what we're going to do, guys? We're going to use this pen on this today. All right, guys, let's get into the video. Let's get into the video. I'm kind of really in a good mood. <laughs> if you guys have not been able to tell, but I am. Got my little handy dandy <sighs> Ooh, uh, calculator right here. Going to go ahead and get into this video. So, before, you know, what we do here for the May budget, and, you know, actually what I'm going to do is make this into a one-pager. Alright, so what we do for the May budget in the beginning of the month, I potentially put what my potential income could be as far as what I get. I put all my bills here, how much I budget for. So, something could be more, something could be less, you may never know. So, what I'm going to do, actually, anything that is, and we do this every month, if you do not... Are you, if you're not familiar with this, this is what I do. I'm gonna put if I gain, if I lost. If I, in the negative with some money, if I didn't budget right, it's in the red. If I did budget right, it's in the green, or if it's more. So, right now, that's what we're gonna do. Like I said, here's my bag of pens. Don't get on me. Do not talk about me, okay? So, yes, I have three new pens now to my collection. And once again, I'm still going to order some more from E. Michelle, hey. Mm. Okay, so, all right, I'm really in a really good mood. <laughs> I'm really in a good mood, guys, but you know what? It's a good thing. Okay, so, right now, what we're going to do is my May budget. As I said, probably 50 times now. So, what we're going to do each, and I'll go ahead and, and um, go through, write whatever it is. If it's the same, if nothing changed, I put a line here. If it's something changed, like I said, we're going to use the green or the, or the um, red here to, to track and make sure I'm good. I also added in, 
you know, here's my daycare, <clears throat> here's my shopping that I budget for the month and unbudget it. So this can change, but right now what we're gonna do, I got most of this stuff already paid. Let's go ahead and knock it out. Alrighty guys, so right now, let's zoom you in. Okay, so now that you are zoomed in, hopefully you can see it, right? I got my little note from Cami. I love my little notes. And you know what, just for that, I'm so going to put Beverly's note here as well. I like to keep little things like this. I really do. You know what I mean? It's just great memorabilia. I just, I just, I just love it. You know, I love to keep my notes, guys. I do, <laughs> especially my personalized notes. I like to keep. So I just love them. So anyway, guys, let's get into the video. I'm so excited. So <laughs> this month has been crazy, <laughs> but fun but crazy um we're gonna start off with my rent my rent payment was literally the same where i don't have anything going on here um uh, my water bill believe gosh i keep giving you guys i just can't wait for june let's just say that um yep for sure yeah my water bill was actually 80 on a dot i'm excited the cruise oh let me tell you about the cruise so when i call to make a payment okay it wow i keep doing that every time i call and make a payment well the first time i made a payment and i had 65 here you know what i mean well that's how much i actually paid but going forward it's not going to be 65 dollars it's actually going to be um 72 i'm rounding it up to 72 maybe 73 i think it's 72 pretty sure um this is my first progress card i actually spent to 50 dollars here the phone bill the phone bill was a little bit cheaper let me see here god i keep doing that i need to stop doing that guys to y'all <laughs> the phone bill you know what our phone bill was cheaper and i know that i know my phone bill was cheaper hold the phone <laughs> Hold on one second, guys. I gotta pause. I gotta pause. I gotta check this right, real guys, quick. guys, I am back. I had to check to make sure that everything was fine. My phone bill was actually $178.65. That's how much my phone bill was. So what we are going to do here, now I budget $108. We gonna minus $178.65. I made $178.65. Oh my gosh. And I actually, since it was less amount i'm gonna say it was a dollar 35 difference so actually what i'm gonna do since it was changed i'm just gonna rewrite it in the green writing i'm kind of like writing sideways i hate this because the coils are like right here so that was a plus on um, my car insurance i uh, ain't nothing changing with that shoot <laughs> my car no ain't nothing changing with that You understand? Ain't nothing changing with that. Planet Fitness, yes, $23. Electric, now my electric bill actually was a little different. Let me tell y'all. <sighs> was a little different. <sighs> All right, let me see, gas and electric. Electric was actually put 70 and $70. And then for my gas, 65. 65 for my electric and gas. So I was a negative for both of these. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So I'm gonna put 70 here, 65 here because it was more that I paid out of pocket, but for what I budget, and that's why that's in the red. Now the spectrum, of course, absolutely 50. That nothing has changed there. Acorns, nothing had changed there. Capital One, that daggone card, nothing changed there. <laughs> I hate that daggone card. Groceries. Now, let's go back into what I have spent. And I know it's, I know it's early in the game, but I'm just going to get this done and over with for now. So, groceries, what I say? $150? All right, so... For food over here, you guys can't see that. So for food, 
I said I have about $15.88 left. $15.88 left. I can't talk bad. $15.88. So I spent about $134. And I mean, the month is still not over with. I mean, I could probably spend this, but you know what I'm gonna do? I'm just gonna mark that as Oh, and 12 cents. Can't forget the 12 cents now. I'm just knocking this all out. We're gonna see though. I'm putting on having a no spend week, period. We're gonna, we're gonna see, right? We're gonna see. Oh, you guys can't even see what I'm doing. Oh my goodness. Car gas, whoo! Let's go back into trying not to do that to you guys again. So we're going back to my check-in, my car gas, a budget of $50, $50 minus. Where I'm at in gas, $35. Like I said, I haven't been able to, you know what I mean, I only spend about $15 in gas. That's not bad. That's not bad. $15. So we're gonna write this $15. I'm sorry, you guys. I'm trying to make sure you guys are in the view. I'm gonna write that $15 over here, yeah. So put that in the green. Um, daycare. Ooh, let me tell you about daycare. Actually, I spent $225 because of Memorial Day. So that actually showed me some money. And then, so that was, yeah. And of course I'd like calculated here because I thought I was done, but I wasn't. Now shopping, heh, shopping. Let's go back again. Cause I, you know, that's in my weekly check-in. So for my shopping, back over here again. What I budget for, $50? So here we go, 50. It is like pouring down raining outside right now. I know you guys can hear that. Right now I'm left off with $14.02, so mine's $14.02. Spent about $35.98. $35.98. There, look, $35.98. So that leaves me in the green for $35. You know, this is very rewarding when you look and see like how much you spent and all that such, you know what I mean? And the unbudgeted. Now, started with $100 for the unbudgeted. Oh my god, I'm so sorry, guys. <laughs> Starting with the hundred dollars of the unbudgeted. I'm sorry guys. I'm so sorry. I hate to be that you guys are not in the frame. Um trying to keep you guys in the frame. I need to like I don't feel like zooming zooming in and out. It's just a pain in the butt right now. So hundred dollars for the unbudgeted. I got a remaining my minus four dollars and sixty-two sixty-seven cents. Alright, that's how much spend was ninety-five dollars. Get you back in the frame. <laughs> Ninety-five dollars. 33 cents, blah, 33 cents is what I spent. So, 95.33. And yeah, and actually guys, actually I got something else I need to add to the month. And that is my Cricut. I am actually making payments on my Cricut because I wasn't not, I was not for sure on what I wanted to do for that and actually Today marks the day, there I go again, I made my first payment with my Cricut. So this is in yellow because this is the balance or payment that's usually not my regular payment. So that's why I have it as a different color. So it's $53.99. So right now, I'm just gonna go ahead and do this. $53.99, it was an expense that I had to add for this month. So right now, I'm just gonna write this in the red because I did not have this like I should have, you know what I mean? So, what we're gonna do is go ahead and calculate everything here. And I'm gonna actually speed up the video really quick. My actual for the month that I budget everything for 
I'm sorry, $2,426.30 is where I'm at. Now, like I said, I budgeted $2,700, okay? This is how much everything came up for. And this is the ending for the end of the month. Okay, I know I said I probably could still have to do spending for whatever, but right now, I'm not planning on doing no spending. I know I probably have probably on budgeted somewhere. Let's not jinx myself. So what I'm going to do here, which I, I don't do, but I'm going to do it for this time, is calculate. Everything's pretty much the same. Now, I was going to put my gains and losses up here. Hmm. I never really do that, do I? No. No, I'm not going to do it that way. I, don't, I think that will be pretty weird. So right now, what I'm just going to, I'm going to keep that at $2,426.30. Right now, I'm just not, I'm just not going to put nothing here. I don't want to put anything there. So right now, I can see, okay, my phone bill was a little bit cheaper. This was over, this was over. Cheaper, 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 cheaper. And of course, this was unbudget at all. Next month, let's do better. So that is what i have for my may budget as i'm going to go ahead and end with i definitely want to let you guys know i absolutely love this pin um and you guys know i also had purchased two other pins from other shops and this is from my teacher's cupboard and i got this one from uh shoot wait a minute <laughs> I, I i don't want to get i don't want to get it wrong i don't want to get it wrong so um bdl design co bdl design so um i think it's i think that's her her initials <laughs> i believe so bdl design company um that is where i received my and these are all rose gold you know i'm doing a rose gold gang 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 so in the rose gold coils coil coil coils Alrighty, guys so i'm pretty excited about that not too bad but at the same time also have another potential paycheck coming through so let's say pretty much because i said 880 let me see here so i have another paycheck coming through but it's on the 31st so technically you know that paycheck is going towards the june bills so right now this is where i'm going to end this is not too bad but when you look at this and what's gonna, i don't see where i'm saving let me see here we're gonna we're gonna do it this way minus $2,426.30. Let, let me show you something. Where is this extra $273.07? You know what I mean? But that's just what I budgeted. You know what I mean? So, yeah. It's just... It's pretty crazy. Unless my math is wrong over here. Now, what did I get? Oh, I know what I did. I know exactly what I did. Oh my gosh, guys, look at this. So, my income, I have budgeted because remember when I wanted to put them out because I was anticipating on getting my gar my payments garnished? Yeah, this is where this extra budget comes from. So, with everything here, you know, pretty tight. <laughs> pretty tight, you know? Um... I might need to recalculate something really quick because I, I just confused myself. Oh my gosh. I believe I did. Hold on one second, guys. I was really tripping so how much so this is what I did I had calculated how much between my paychecks and what I get from Bay from here I budgeted this much but not saying I was getting this much but at the end of the day this is how much everything was here 
this is how much I actually came out. So, $2,507.22 minus $2,426.30. That just brought me at $80.92 difference between what I budgeted and my actual. Okay, does that make sense? <laughs> I was like, why do I feel, see this is what messed me up because I budgeted here, which I shouldn't have probably did. I mean, I can, I can say, okay, this is my, what I believe my income gonna be, this is how much I'm budgeting for, this is how much my actual for all the bills are, and then when I go back through, we really do the real actual because things can change. You get it? So that is what I have for this video. This is how much it says that I have left. Now I had the amount that I have left from the total amount from these balances, from the shopping on budgeted, the car and all that stuff. Plus what I had for the month, it was what we had. I'm just going back and re, you know, let you guys know. I had, like I said, the remaining amount for my check-ins that's still around. Plus my first paycheck, $36 and then $21.81 for my second pay. And that pretty much gives me back around to my $80.92. Okay guys, all right, I feel better. I thought I literally messed something up so bad that I was like, what in the world was I doing? So guys, that concludes my video. I like to thank BDL Design Co. for sending me my lovely rose gold pen. I absolutely love it. And it's blue, but these two here are the um black so not bad they all write very smooth and if you don't have one i advise you have one because you know i got the floating glitter plan and i got and of course you know why i got this of course you you guys should know that by now and uh yeah i got some fancy pens <laughs> so i try to keep this for my planner you know like the e michelle's i was using those e michelle pens like it wasn't no tomorrow and that's probably why i'm so sad because i killed them but that's okay <laughs> i'm going to order more Thank you guys so much for viewing this video. I definitely appreciate it. And I will see you guys in the next one.